Hello and welcome back to our series on electrical and computer engineering. Our conversation tonight is about sources transformations. Two videos ago, we learned how to simplify two elements in series and two elements in parallel. However, that very evening, I warned you that most of the time elements are neither in series nor in parallel. That's why we've learned to identify a y of elements and transform that into a delta of elements and a delta convert that into a y. Why is that? So we can continue simplifying elements in series and elements in parallel. However, that wasn't enough. That's why tonight I will show you how to transform a branch like this one into a pair of elements like these two. Why do we want to do that? Yes, we want to continue simplifying elements in series and elements in parallel. Remember when you're simplifying, do not oversimplify. If you know in advance that you will be needing the current, the voltage or the power in a given element, do not simplify that one element, leave it alone. With that caveat, I think we're ready. Let's begin.